Hi, Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh and very good morning everyone. I'm Siti Nurbay binti Mama Yusuf. I'm from University Malaysia Sabah. Today, I will present a study entitled The Impact of Social Media on Brand Awareness During the COVID-19 Pandemic, a Preliminary Review. Okay, as for the introduction, since the COVID-19 outbreak, the number of people using social media has increased considerably as the government encourages people to stay at home and break the transmission cycle. People have become increasingly reliant on their smartphones to complete daily tasks such as ordering food from delivery services, purchasing electronic devices via online shopping websites or even social media platforms communicating with loved ones or attending work meetings via video calls and online chat services and so on. Several businesses and government agencies have begun to increase internet awareness of their brands and products. With today's emphasis on social media, businesses may engage with existing and potential customers more easily online. Okay, for problem statement, our reliance on social media has grown significantly, particularly during COVID-19, since it has become one of our primary sources of pandemic information and a critical tool for us to live our contactless new norms life. Okay, everything we do is centered on technology, uh, including grocery shopping, bill payments, school assignment submission, and even working from home. Okay. MCMC, the Malaysian Communications and Multimedia Commission, conducted an internet user survey 2020, which revealed that 88.7% of internet users used the internet in 2020, compared to 87.4% in 2018. Okay, and this uh, sociological phenomenon has also influenced current consumer behavior and prompted firmly to reconsider their advertising, marketing, and media tactics, okay? And the growing reliance on social media among people during the COVID-19 uh, outbreak has demonstrated social media's ability to successfully um, create brand awareness. And however, there is a paucity of current research and modern viewpoints on our new normal communication, such as how successful uh, social media is at raising brand awareness during a pandemic. Um, it's a uh, um, um, it's process and also techniques. Okay, With, and whether it is more effective than traditional marketing approaches. So, as a result, the goal of this uh, research is to learn more about the influence and usefulness of the social media as a digital marketing tool on brand awareness during the COVID-19 pandemic. There are two objectives uh, of this research. Um, number one is to see if social media can help companies create brand awareness during the COVID-19 pandemic through digital marketing. Number two is to research and comprehend the value of social media content, planning and scheduling in reaching and efficiently communicating with the COVID-19 pandemic's target population. Okay, as we can see now, uh, a lot of business close down their physical stores. But this doesn't mean that they are bankrupt uh, and stop the business for good, but they actually change their business strategy by going online, uh, where they sell their goods via online, especially using social media platforms. Okay, And the significance of this study is Understanding the rise of digital marketing in the face of a worldwide pandemic, as well as the relationship between social media uh, usage and brand awareness, uh, will aid in better understanding the future of business, marketing, and communication. Okay, this research should also be studied in order to fully comprehend the potential of social media with the aim that the findings would be useful in the digital marketing business during the COVID-19 pandemic. This study rationalized the need of analyzing social media and its impact on brand awareness. 
Okay, as for the research methodology, the online poll, which used a quantitative survey approach, was done in August 2021 to look into the impact and effectiveness of social media as a digital marketing tool on brand recognition during the COVID-19 pandemic. It also includes a data gathering of social media users in KK, Kota Kinabalu Sabah, from various demographics. The online survey was delivered via a link that directed people to the databases, which is a Google form. Okay, the study's participants were members of the general public in Kota Kinabalu, Sabah. The respondents were chosen at random uh, from the city of KK population. Respondents range in age from students uh, to the general public who have been exposed to social media marketing. Okay, the questions in this survey are separated into numerous areas, including Section A, Demographic, Section B, the relevance of social media marketing during COVID-19 pandemic, and also Section C, the impact of social media marketing and brand awareness during COVID-19 pandemic. Okay, Section A is to aim to, uh, to gather information from participants in KK. This component of the questionnaire asks about the participants' race, age, and gender, as well as their awareness of social networking tools, where Section B aims to determine the impact, influence, and efficacy of social media on brand recognition among consumers during the pandemic. Participants were given simple rating scale with yes or no replies and the questions were brief and ambiguous. Uh, and section C is to determine whether social media marketing is more relevant than traditional marketing tactics amid the COVID-19 pandemic. And this part was created using a five-point Likert scale as a closed-ended questionnaire. Um, number one is strongly disagree until number five strongly agree. Okay, actually, there are a quite a number of literature review that I wrote in my article that related to this um, presentation. And um, okay, the first one is social media marketing has made it easier for businesses to raise brand awareness and it is less expensive than traditional marketing tactics and takes less time to establish. Okay, um, as for the second one is marketers are starting to understand how to include social media into their marketing strategies and campaigns to reach out to uh, to customers okay uh, as stated by nada raja and yasdani fart 2013 because the social media industry is still developing and producing better analytic um, features it has aided marketers in gaining better and more effective insight okay um, people spend an increasing amount of time online searching for information on products and services communicating with other consumers about their experiences and engaging with companies according to the et al 2021 okay According to Rohana, Shuhaida, and Mastura 2020, a competitive brand is the driving factor behind a company's economic growth. They define branding as the strategic process by which a corporation develops a competitive brand. Okay, and the last one is as uh, social media is one of the most powerful marketing platforms for increasing brand awareness and improving brand image as well as contributing to brand financial performance, said Aydin, Yuri, and Zilata Roglu, 2020. Okay, now we look at the research findings, okay? According to Table 1, um, the study's finding shows that 38% of the 100 respondents were male and 62% were female. In terms of age, 37% of respondents are between the ages of 31 and 35, while 22% are over the age of 41. Only 19% of respondents were between the ages of 26 and 30, and 14% were between the ages of 36 and 40. Only 8% of respondents were between the age of 18 and 25. In terms of employment, 54% were private employees, 21% government employees, 9% housewife, and 7% students. 
with jobless respondents accounting for 1% of the overall population. Meanwhile, 8% of respondents say that they don't agree with all of the above. Okay, now we look at the knowledge level. The purpose of this question is to find out whether respondents had any prior knowledge of social media as this could have influenced their selections in section B and C. Beginner, basic, average and expert were the four response options given to respondents. According to table 2 below, the majority of respondents, which is 69%, rate their understanding of social media um, as average, 25% as basic, and 6% as ex expert. Given the importance of social media during the COVID-19 outbreak, it's hardly surprising that none of the respondents claim to have a beginner's level of understanding. Everyone paham tentang uh, social media, uh, of course. <laughs> Okay, um, now we look at the effectiveness of social media in creating brand awareness during the COVID-19 pandemic. The table uh, below, in next slides actually, corresponds to the research question about the effectiveness of social media in raising brand awareness during the pandemic. Okay, respondents were given a Likert scale of uh, strongly disagree, disagree, neutral, agree and strongly agree. According to Table 3, the majority of respondents strongly agreed that social media is an important marketing tool. Okay, they also agreed that it is a good tool for a product or company during the COVID-19 pandemic. Continuous postings, according to the majority of respondents, help to create trust in a brand or product. When it comes to products supported by celebrities or influencers, nearly half of respondents believe that their trust is based on the popularity of a social media account while the majority of respondents are neutral. Um, as for the importance of social media strategy in attracting and engaging with audiences during COVID-19 pandemic, the table uh, in next slides answers whether a well-planned social media campaign is essential to attract audiences during the COVID-19 pandemic. Planning and arranging your material as well as having effective relationship with followers are all part of social media tactics. Respondents were given the option of answering yes or no. Okay, the table four shows that during the COVID-19 pandemic, a significant proportion of respondents said that social media marketing influenced their purchasing decision. And during the pandemic, the majority of respondents reported purchasing products from social media account or pages, okay, as well as through social media advertisement, repurchasing a product purchased online, and socially following or liking a brand on social media. Almost half of the respondents become social media marketing product brand loyalists. Uh, they also use social media to learn more about a company or brand. According to the data, half of the respondents did not launch a social media business during the pandemic. However, at least half of them have used social media to advertise. Okay. Okay, um, in conclusion, throughout the pandemic, we have seen effective internet advertising that demonstrated the ability to attract customers far faster while also increasing brand loyalty. It also emphasizes the importance of studying social media and its impact on brand recognition in order to maximize its use and implement effective effective marketing strategies, particularly for businesses and government bodies. Okay, understanding the full potential of social media can also help us mitigate the economic impact of a future global crisis. The, the findings of the study are planned to serve as a springboard for more in-depth research into the impact of social media on brand awareness during the COVID-19 pandemic. And we can see the following uh, are the results. Okay, the 
the effectiveness of social media on brand awareness during COVID-19 pandemic. According to the findings of the data analysis, respondents felt that social media is a beneficial digital marketing tool for organization to use in creating brand recognition, with the majority of them agreeing on the importance of social media during the pandemic. And it's also worth mentioning that during a pandemic, the majority of respondents agreed that social media marketing is more realistic. Okay, uh, COVID-19 has forced us to adopt a more technological, uh, technologically advanced lifestyle, pushing us to come up with new methods to live while avoiding the virus. Marketers must rethink how they assess uh, and target the current consumer as a result of this shift in behavior. As a result, children born at this age um, will have a different life than those born before the pandemic. Um, currently, it's vital to take advantage of the opportunity to explore and research the current situation as it will improve marketing technology and communication in the future. And the last one, the importance of social media strategy in attracting and engaging with audiences during COVID-19 pandemic. Um, maintaining a solid social media presence requires engagement among brands and followers. It has the ability to turn followers into paying consumers, right? Creating useful social media content will aid in the conversion of current followers into committed clients. And during COVID-19, this study focused on how valuable and effective social media is as a marketing tool with the goal of providing a clearer and deeper understanding of its possibilities. It's important to remember that in successful marketing, both the brand and the customer are crucial. Okay, researching more about social media and its functionality will be a big assistance in preparing for another global crisis by identifying that ali what aligns with one another, especially in a circumstances, uh, circumstance involving a country's economic well-being. This study can also benefit consumers by providing a better understanding of how social media might aid brand exposure and digital communication. Okay, that's all for now. Um, thank you so much. Bye. Assalamualaikum.